This is Duke University. These dancing robots are twirling on a stage that is only a millimeter square. The technology to control such tiny machines comes from the lab of Duke University professor Bruce Donald and has implications for manipulating human cells. This is a 1,000 scale model of one of these micro robots and this is the width of a human hair. So the key question is how can you manage to control and power and differentiate the activities of a team of these robots that are trying to do a single task such as assembly. Okay so we've seen that the robots can do dance maneuvers but let's see if they could actually do a task and one of the most interesting tasks at this scale the most important is to assemble another structure. Now what you're seeing here is the motions of the robots when they're all receiving the same electrical pulses but they're responding differently. Over drawn on here are the view of what a planning algorithm wants the robots to do. So in the next moment the trajectory will be accomplished and the final robot will have docked into the last structure. Particular applications we're most excited about are in collaborations with the Medical Center here at Duke. We hope to use these in order to probe the molecular and cellular architectures of very small things such as cells. Produced by Duke University. Online at duke.edu.